Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Team Pandori Emu Chicken. And we've got a package. A very long package, and apparently it's a game handle. Let's see what's inside, shall we? Karate chop. Not quite sure what happened there. Oh, what is this? GameCube? Ah, yes, that's right. I ordered some pads that look nothing like N64 pads, but they are N64 pads. Boxes are not in the best condition. What do you expect, really? As long as it protects what's inside. We have a D-pad, N64, googly thing, C key. Beauty's only skin deep. Let's open her up. Looking good. There's absolutely nothing outside the pad. I mean, who needs instructions for a pad, right? The cable's 1.8 meters. And yeah, this analog stick feels fantastic. And you know what? It feels great in the hand too. The analog stick is very smooth. The D-pad is slightly smaller than stock. And the buttons, they feel like Smarties. On the top we have L, R, and not one, but two Z buttons. It molds <laughs> perfectly in the hands. It's two Z buttons, that's awesome. There's even the expansion port in the back. And the blue one feels the same, just different color. Turning on the N64, we can have a little race test. It's actually a lot more sensitive than the original pad. It's an absolute blast to play. I kind of wish they had these as stock, to be honest. With the rumble pack in. If you have a Nintendo 64 laying around, do yourself a favor. Get one of these. They're cheap feel great and make me want to play the N64. This has been Amy Chicken of Team Pandori, and I'll catch you on the flips. Ta-ra!